Oh, Darts here looks uh, like a very Bloodseeker, yeah. Tundra Esports turned Tide on. Beast or Mars or Tide? Yeah, tide. Dark. Who's your hero? Yeah, they just moved the Visage to support. Pretty much any hero in the game is dead in the laning phase, so let's see how it ends up working out here and how much aggression they can actually pose with it as. All right, they're gonna send snaking top with 33, and they're gonna have Aoi leaning bottom with this. Uh, well, what's this to try and dodge or to try and force uh, in terms of matchups? They want the bat in particular versus the Nagasarn with this uh, Dark Seer. Now they actually have ways to kill the illusions, right? They have an Iron Shell, they have Flame Break plus Firefly. You can actually do some decent damage. 33, it still looks like it's gonna be a tough lane for him in particular. He's, oh, he's dead. And yeah, he's just gone. They are gonna be able to get that first blood there. 33, not able to run away at level one, of course, with just the Iron Shell. Not having the the easiest of times CSing against 33 and snaking. It's definitely not an easy, not the easiest lane because he's under he's under kill threat constantly. Yeah, that snaking's trying to get in underneath the tower. Pointing that, of course, will hold back the bat rider, but the surge comes he's in. Hit. The firefly. They're just going to continue to cause issues for Mane here. Okay, they've got tombstone. They'll push him off. I don't believe snaking was ion shelled either. I think 33 was low mana. But yeah, they have so much magic damage. 33, he's going to die for this aggression. I mean, that, that, you know, th this is good for us. You know, sure, nice they're, they're not getting the CS, but. But it's never going to be easy. Yeah, I mean, next success is always mm. going to be able to step up and, mm. and try and bully you back from the Aya. Nine might just get dove here in the mid lane. They have a tombstone available. Uh, this, this looks to be a sure, sure kill. TPs are coming in, nice but move. nothing can be done there to save nine from the it's gang. A? Okay, Sumail low on mana. Can't actually go for the play here. But they're rotating the Io over Baboka. He's got a healing Lotus up. Snae's actually going pretty aggressive. Gonna out. We're going to see that Baboka's so much. going to be perfectly fine. It, it, it's... it's it's, it's going to be difficult to use this early strength that Skeeter's managed to amass, I feel. Yep, I definitely agree with you there. The things that they do have to do with Naga Siren, though, is, I mean, they will have a lot of magic damage overall throughout the game to clear. And Are they going to pop the Dark Ravage for this? And okay. Ravage into the well stun. Skeeter's gone. Samal joins forces with XXS to take down the carry. And now they have Meter Hammer, so they can actually potentially start setting up for a push here. Nine is going to swing back around. There's a sentry prep for him. Uh, they're going to they're gonna turn us down the ground. Nine. He's in trouble. He is in a whole he lot of trouble. Gone. Not oh, just Skeeter oh. going down on the bottom lane, nine as well. Blow up nine instantly. Uh, top, they're going to look for Pichu as Snakey He's diving six. in, but uh, they're, they're a little hesitant. He's too tanky. Oh, I'm fully committing for this. Snakey's I'm dying. just going to go down, I think. He's trying to take out the tombstone. He'll get the tombstone. He's oh. got the lasso. Oh, he gets him. get the kill. Snakey. Right. Getting the first kill on the board for Tundra here. Yo, road to recovery. He's actually switched the build. He's gone for Yasha now. So incredibly fragile All right. on this Razor. Top snaking. He's oh. going to get caught. The hammer's there in time from XXS. I love that we're seeing this again, actually. I feel like it just disappeared from the meta, and now we're only seeing one hero in the game by Meteor Hammer, and it's Tidehunter. We get it sometimes on Doom. Yeah, I don't like that, though. You don't, you don't like the Doom? No, I don't really like it so much. Nine. Go for play up top here. We do have the relocate coming in in XXS. We'll have potential with the Ravage to turn this around. They'll lose Pichu, but may have the chance to set up for nine in return. Actually, oh. out with the Familiars there. Remember, the Familiars done onto the two of them. And Samel, he's he cannot heal. The Bloodstone heal. Is it going to be enough to keep him alive? No. He's gone. Nine survives, takes the double. They'll turn towards XXS. He tries for a TP out. They might not be able to stop it, but they it, might get there in time. It's going to be very close. Yeah, I, they, they, they're definitely going to be able to challenge this Tundra. He's running in. Level four vacuum. It's getting low. See if we can get it for the setup. The snake is going to step forward. They use the song. Song here to ensure they can finish Roshan. They grab the Aegis on Samael. They've got a Ravage. He's ready, XXS, and out it comes here. We'll catch on to the three of them. We'll try and focus Snaking first, but with the Firefly, he's able to get back out of the pit. Nine moves him with the Static Link on towards Monet. There's nine. That's to keep the distance careful. for Samael. XXS gets back in with the Gush of the Anchor Skeeter. Smash, takes down nine. Skeeter's cleaning up. Samael's still got mana to play with, but indeed with this BKB, Skeeter it finally comes to an end. Samael. Trying to close the gap on Skeeter. Skeeter, him. can he get away from this angry lightning pony? Surge, Surge is there. Skeeter's running away. He'll escape. Snaking, he'll be the one left behind. As Asta will clean up the bat. Oh, oh Snake? Is he actually going to get out with his Firefly? Oh, he has no TP, though. Firefly. Oh. He's it's, hiding in the corner of the map. Gonna They're, They're actually going to give up on chasing him. Snaking gets out alive. Pipe 2 to rally around. Yeah, they're, they're respecting that timing here, Tundra. Bottom. Nine. He's been found. Monet. They've got him. Setup's there. Damage. 
Mone able to do this now with his Orchid complete. Anybody here? BKB is going to last long enough. That's kind of my concern for Tundra. The Razor BKB and the Bloodseeker BKB versus this crazy amount of sustain that Aster has in these upcoming fights. They're going to try and go for XXS. Good link. Has backup, and uh, he will indeed Got not it. get the chance to use the Ravage because Nine's put the BKB, so no point uh, spending the ultimate for that. Nice, nice back in there. Oh my The bird stuns. The four of them. The full up stun comes in. They Woo! completely destroyed. Triple kill for Nine. They're going to get the cleanup. Okay, well. Uh, they weren't ready for that. They Aster. were not. And, ooh. Okay, Nine. Very close to having his nullifier done. So. Skeena. He's going to start things here with a rupture. He's looking for XXS. Pots the BKB. He wants to come in in for this kill. Goes up to the high ground. Takes him out of the tier three. <laughs> They're going to turn towards Samael as well. Samael. He's got the Ags. He's got the Ags. A bit of protection here with the Nihilism. Another over from Baboka. Baboka's going to opt to take him out. Okay. Gets him away from the fight. That's the one BKB use. Skitter. Actually, that's two BKB use. So Tundra. I'll have to back away after that kill. Five very strong heroes. This is going to be a, quite a treat to watch how these fights do go out. Monet. For the north side. Monet's very close to a BKB. They actually get a rupture onto the real one. Yes, yeah, is going to start the fight here. Commits him with the BKB. Monet, he's got to get taken out of this. But Boca will save him. Sumail's isolated. It means the others are left behind. He just, two he's seconds. The bloodstone is gone. The it's gone. Is gone. But he's, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> he's dead. Nines him with another fire. Sumail's out. The timing's falling perfectly there for Tundra, as now they'll chase down more. They'll look towards XXS, the flame break splitting him from Baboka, as what XXS is gone, Baboka out as well. Tundra strike at the perfect time. I mean, and for slow, get the, this game in a good position for the Naga Siren. But these team fights, Tundra have just destroyed them. Monet's got the set Everyone's respawning. Are they going to be able to get in time to, to benefit off the song? Where's the BKBs? They're still cooldown. Ravage. Here they can catch. It's a four-man Ravage, and they're focusing 33. They'll get 33. Skinner. He's trying to stand his ground, but he's caught by the stuns. Two cores to be found, maybe more. They'll look over towards Nine. Nine has the BKB back up in seven seconds. Net. That's that. Can they kill him quick enough? Two seconds to BKB, but the hammer comes in. Asta, they will hold. Monet with the song. Sets up for the turnaround. They keep the base safe. They keep the tier three alive on Asta. So this is a refresher shard, though. This could just. I mean, they're not I a think, ravage. I think XXS is ready to pick it up. Yeah, nine. He's gonna head into the pit. He's gonna try and force the boy to get the vacuum. The wall. The familiar stuns coming out. Nine. He's gonna it. get the kill and get the ages. Nine gets the pickups. It's a rough state now. This fight for Asta. They might have to bail out of this one. Monet pops the song. He's gonna opt for the song TP. Samel's TPing out. XXS as well. They'll get away. The TPs will allow themselves to to save one another. Pichu's left behind. A good escape there from Asta, but overall, claimed. Tundra, they get the rush, they get that Aegis. Could have been a whole lot messier for Asta, but how he goes for this next play here, because having without no without a buyback here, yeah. could just get the lead in the double ravage is gonna be something that Asta's timing for. BKB, get him away from Samal. Nine's in on top of Monet. Monet's got to run, and of course, Song's still in cooldown. He does not have that to protect, protect himself. Relocate coming over from Baboka. He's in with the tear that Monet's back up to the high ground. They protect him. Get back and away from this. Skeeter's turning his attention over towards Samael. Samael, not the bloodstone. Skeeter, Skeeter. He's going to put the BKB. He wants to get back in on this. He feels like he can maybe take down Samael. He's under the tier three tower. Samael's falling low. They've got him. He's killed Samael off. Monet turns with the net on towards Skeeter, but Skeeter's still surviving. Ravage. The There's the Ravage. Onto the three of them. XX says he puts the refresher. He's a little low on mana. Oh, he's not going to be able to get the second Ravage off. He doesn't have enough mana. As that's the tier three gone. Three dead on Asta. The creeps are coming in. They can take this mid set of Rax Tundra and almost certainly look for a second second lane. This is all three cores dead for a minute. No buy. You know, he's he's kind of been the initiator. He just yep. BKBs ruptures. He goes in. He forces the start of the fight. And it's just been too much for Asta. They make, Vista support. Gone. They make the Vista support work for Aoi. Let's see if Asta can push them back in these final moments. It doesn't look like it. And indeed, they can't. GG is called cool. Tundra will take game one. Monkey King. You may now select your heroes. He was the X Factor. He literally won them the game with two or three back-to-back -back black holes. I mean, it wasn't just him, of course, but yeah. The impact that he was able to have isn't really replaceable by almost any other hero, so... Yeah, I definitely feel like we could see quite a bit more of this one coming out. Because it's... Oh, we'll have kill threat, but if you just pull the lane back constantly, Timber's gonna be able to farm up here versus the monkey. D not... They're not really gonna be able to pressure the monkey king by any means, probably, but... Snaking actually steps up a bit far and might have actually just given this fight. 
Right, he's looking pretty dead here. Firefly's coming in. Can he try for a deny to neutrals? He'll try for it, but he won't get it. Mone, he'll get first blood. I I guess he was trying to interrupt the pole or something, but uh, yeah, he just gets picked. Swift now wants to continue to move over to get kills. Hello. He's going to walk into this. They've got the DD, an easy kill. He's got the Firefly down to the low ground, but indeed no chance of uh, getting quite far enough away from Nine. As Kisses, look, he's just going to send him onto oh, Monet. Long range as well. Starting this from very far away. Connects with one of them. A couple, two, three, four. Four hits there with the Kisses. Is it enough to let them get the kill? 33's out of mana. Monet was his way out of this one. He, they he's see him the, the whole trees. time is the issue. Can he actually get the distance? He's getting pretty far. I think that'll do it. Monet. Helming again. He's going to hit the six, but difficult to make a play against XXS on his own. Oop. With the rupture. Batrider again. Can't even get the shield rune. <laughs> yeah, we Boca. just him away from it. And he's going to keep Peach alive. Nine has a shield rune. This is a tough kill. There's no way Samal can get this. And backup comes in from Skeeter. Skeeter's ready to help turn. They just turn towards Samal. They've got him. Nice TP. Good wreck. Turns up and enables Tundra to get a very easy kill against Samal. Whoa. Peach, you careful. Might just die up here. I mean, 33's here with the Shockroom. They're surrounding. I mean, is it? Uh, he's been in some risky spots here, Peach. He sure has. First time round, you know, he was lucky enough to get sort of bailed out by Baboka. Uh, but that in turn did mean that Samel was not able to be ba bailed out by Baboka. Bottom side. I don't. I think it saw the TP in from the Lesh, maybe? I actually don't think it did, because Skeeter actually gets caught from the rotation anyway. But yeah, I've never seen that ward. So yeah, I guess sort of move. yeah catches anyone kind of coming from the base, what's swinging around to, to go across this little bridge to get... He's found. He keeps getting caught here. He's going to help push Snake in close towards level 6. In the mid, they're going to try for the straight-up setup on a XXS. Yatos into the kisses. XXS got a reload. Push him back with the spear and backups on its way. Mone turns up. Wukong's command is there. The numbers have arrived from Asta and 9. He'll fall, maybe Aoi as well. TP's to come in from Tundra, but not in time to keep Aoi alive. Skeeter, he's going to look towards XXS with a relocate. Nice retether. As he's able to get XXS out of there, Aster, they could look to push him for more. They take Snaking down. And Monet, going to get turned towards Mosquito because he's already used the rupture, threw it out onto XXS, so there's no further way to threaten Monet. What Aster, they'll take that fight for Boca with the saves. Love it. You don't really see people like breaking tether and retethering like that, but yeah, perfectly done to be able to save on the road 33. Just Skeeter, the one who can slow down a little bit. I mean, they're looking to go on Skeeter. The setup's here from the trees. Mono reveals himself and the relocate nice from catch. Boboca brings some ale over. Chain Frost. They should be able to split this indeed, put the Chain Frost to an end. So it won't really be any real They're going for more. Oh, XXS. Cuts the tree. It does indeed cut the tree, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> they didn't need Mone to hit in that one as they still bring down Owie. Nine. Black hole. He's also going to get chased. It's a black hole only onto some out for now, but it's it enough works. to kill him. It's still going to be Tundra losing more casualties, you would imagine, or maybe not with 33 coming in and on top of XXX. XXX tries for the TP out, but the timber chain's there. Tundra. Able to pick up some kills in response to that bit of an aggressive dive from Asta off the back of the black hole. And inside these lanes, because I think that's the way the Tundra can really kind of falter in this game, is if they just give up too many kills to these relocates and these global threats coming out here. Oh, here we go. Thanks, XS. He's just going to go for Aoi. Samael and Baboka will turn up. Aoi's still alive. Pretty much gets off his whole toolkit. He's still alive. How? They couldn't kill Aoi. And now Skeeter, he's going to try and turn. It looks towards Samael. Samael get killed off. Skeeter, he's out of the Wukongs. He's fine. A Skeeter will live. They turn with the stun onto Monet. It's Tundra that are taken down too. And maybe even more. Owie's he's still alive. He's down the Monkey King. XXS, he'll finally oh. kill Owie <laughs> off. But Owie got so much done there. Baboka comes in with a tether. Monet alive, nine. Another cookie forward. Skeeter's ready to get back in. The Chakram from 33 takes out Monet. Tundra, they could continue this cleanup. 33 still got mana to play with. They're toying with XXS as they're just dancing around them. Skeeter keeping his distance, tries to offer up another blood right from afar, but won't connect. It doesn't matter though. Cookie from nine wow. allows Skeeter to jump back in onto XXS. Tundra uh, with the outplay and with the unkillable heroes, Aoi, they, they just couldn't kill him, Aster. Now they're going to get the lasso on top. 33 is tanky with pipe. That was tough to kill, and he's got nine here. XXS. He'll lay down the arena. Nice catch. We'll be able to catch nine. And with 33 trapped in there, is there any way for him to get out? No, the arena lasts too long. 33 this time around will get caught. That's a good arena. And uh, now, Owie this time should be in a whole world of pain. Not too difficult for Monet to jump in, take him down. So I see them. They didn't ever take it, did they? That's still, that's still dire, right? 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> red, right? Yeah, but I'm just like, they just walked by it like three times, so. Oh, Monet, oh. he gets jumped out. Oh my god. That was so close. He gets off the tree just before it gets cut. He's now going to be getting in. They're going forward with the black they hole. There. Snake, he's got the control. Monet's getting away. The black hole will do it. They're able to kill Monet off. But in fact, it's Snake and Nice. He it. denied the Aegis as well. I mean, this fight looks like it still very much will go the way of Asta. Uh, but not without Snake trying to do his best to, to, to make the overall situation better. Oh, as this black hole kills Monet. Uh, and he's able to deny the Aegis. Hey, you I mean, it's two ults committed there out from Tundra, so Aster wants something. Shikita's gonna put the BKB. So close. So that's, yeah, a few ults for Tundra and a BKB used. This is go time for Aster. They get He's able to off. find it. Find Skeeter here, trying to BKB TP out, but the lasso comes into play. Skeeter's gone. Run while you have him and Nine have been slowed down quite a lot. And old Snake, Blitz on cooldown. Well, finds him. He's got the setup and uh, not a chance. Not a chance for Snaking. Another kill for Samael to play. We'll but at the same time, they're going for more. They can find Aoi on top of this. They've already got nine. Aoi and 33 trying to run, but as was said before, it's not easy to run from Aster's lineup. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, they actually, oh, they, oh, are they going to give oh, up? The scan? No, the scan's going to connect. They're going to keep chasing. Are they going to go back in there? Do they have a lasso? They don't have lasso, though. 33 will make it away. And so will Aoi. All right. Tundra. Aoi to be caught. As uh, the rest of Tundra, they, they, they ain't going to be turning back for this, surely. Well, uh, they'll leave Aoi to get taken down. They passed the gem over to XXS. I believe it was the Batrider who was carrying it for the I most I mean, Tundra, part, they're still positioning as if they want to fight here. They have a ward. See what they can get. They get the opening onto XXS. He's able to put the BKB. He'll stand his ground. He's able Skitter. to turn, get the spear off onto Skeeter. The follow-up stands there from Samel. They're able to take Skeeter down. He didn't put the BKB. He was felt too confident at the start of that, and he gets punished. I mean, either way, the, I mean, I guess they're feeling like they have some type of hope in the fight, but they're just deleted. Hey, that's a that tough was, target to yeah, go for. A risky call to make there for, from Tundra as we, you know, evidently, you know, they, they decide they want to try and take that fight four versus five. And even if they, like, they're not even in any closeness to during bringing down XXS. The relocate even comes up from Baboka to save him. Now 33. They're looking for him as well. He's stalked and he's in trouble. Setups there from Samael. Follow a spear. Mono's ready to offer up the damage with the Wukong to the bound list. 33's gone. Wow. Huge fights for Aster as Tundra, yeah. I think they just got tripped up from a couple of things like the Nine Razor. A very unexpected pick. The Ali Visage. A ton of damage. The Visage, of course, that bought tons of time to yep. cutting replays and stuff like that. So, yeah, Aster finding their foot. As they attempt to defend this base here. The Agonims from Monet. It's going to get that push going. Oh, oh instant fear. He's going to get caught immediately there, Pichu. Free clicked. All right. They're ready for that one. He, he, he's not happy with that. He buys back straight away. I mean, Monet is still just confidently hitting the tower. They don't. Okay, not just yet, but very close. It's back to the high ground push, still a minute for the ages. Oh, he's caught snaking, but the BKB's back up. Okay. Snaking, he's gonna lasso. get caught by the lasso though. P2, he wants to remove the threat of the Enigma with the drag back. Snaking is gone. No buyback either. He's out for 50. They will not have the black hole to try and make a defensive play with. And Monet just continues to stand his ground. And they're trying to take him low with the cookie combo, but the heels are there from Pavoka. Outside, they're able to push 33 down out of the base. The buyback's now up for Snaking. So he's going to be able to return to the action. Skeeter put the BKB. He'll come to an end. Now he gets caught by this stun from Samael. Not back from the flame break. Boundless strike off the mark, though. Oops. So Skeeter will be allowed to escape. 33 coming in with the secondary buyback on top of... Snake King's hit. Nice Wind Waker, Sumail gets himself out. 33 wants to chase for more. Get the Malefice onto Pichu, Rotovate Toss as well. They'll take out the bat. Something okay. to be found, and that is Pichu dead for 90 seconds. Can Tundra chase for more? They're going to try, but again with the Wind Waker, Sumail gets down to the low ground. Find himself a regen rune. He is perfectly out of there. Tundra still here taking the risk, but they have to. He's got BKB up. Living onto XXS, yeah, puts the BKB straight away. Turns, gets the spear onto Aoi, Snaking has to put the BKB to back off, Moni's gonna move in pretty much one shot, what Aoi it? there, <laughs> as he's gone, Snake just gets deleted, the dream of the black holes, it, it's not gonna happen, I mean Skeeter's trying to fight, they just can't kill Moni, the sustains there from Evoke, ultra kill from Moni, this fight's over, and almost certainly this game is over, does he get the rampage, oh. but the game, indeed, it's done. GG is called. Asta will take game two. <laughs> 33 tips, Snay, at the end. I mean, they definitely.